Hi everybody. The book I'm going to read for you today is a favorite one of my students every single year. This book is called There Was an Old Lady Who Swallowed a Fly. Now I have seen many, many versions of this song in different books with different illustrators and different little takes on the song. Um, while I don't think anyone really knows who wrote the song itself, each person who makes a book about it does it a little bit differently. And this one is done by Sims Tabak, or Tabak. I'm not really sure how to say that name, but that is who came up with the illustrations and the idea behind this version of There Was an Old Lady Who Swallowed a Fly. The first page in the book when you open it up is the publisher page followed by the title page. And again, the title is There Was an Old Lady Who Swallowed a Fly. There was an old lady who swallowed a fly. I don't know why she swallowed the fly. Perhaps she'll die. But it's only a fly. I think I'll cry. She gulped it out of the sky. Oh my. There was an old lady who swallowed a spider that wiggled and jiggled and tickled inside her. She swallowed the spider to catch the fly. But I don't know why she swallowed the fly. Perhaps she'll die. Gone to the by and by. Sigh. There was an old lady who swallowed a bird. How absurd to swallow a bird. She swallowed the bird to catch the spider that wiggled and jiggled and tickled inside her. She swallowed the spider to catch the fly. But I don't know why she swallowed the fly. Perhaps she'll die. She'll leave us high and dry. There was an old lady who swallowed a cat. Imagine that she swallowed a cat. She swallowed the cat to catch the bird. She swallowed the bird to catch the spider. The wiggled and jiggled and tickled inside her. She swallowed the spider to catch the fly. But I don't know why she swallowed the fly. Perhaps she'll die. I hope it's a lie. There was an old lady who swallowed a dog. She went whole hog to swallow the dog. She swallowed the dog to catch the cat. She swallowed the cat to catch the bird. She swallowed the bird to catch the spider that wiggled and jiggled and tickled inside her. She swallowed the spider to catch the fly. But I don't know why she swallowed the fly. Perhaps she'll die. There's a tear in my eye. There was an old lady who swallowed a cow. I don't know how she swallowed the cow. She swallowed the cow to catch the dog. She swallowed the dog to catch the cat. She swallowed the cat to catch the bird. She swallowed the bird to catch the spider that wiggled and jiggled and tickled inside her. She swallowed the spider to catch the fly. But I don't know why she swallowed the fly. Perhaps she'll die. I'd rather have ham on rye. And she had a frog on the sly. And she did it in one try. There was an old lady who swallowed a horse. 
she died, of course. I'm filled with remorse. It was the last course. It is such a loss. She had no time to floss, and she missed out on the sauce. What's left to say? We'll miss her dearly. Even the artist is crying. Dun, dun, dun. And the moral of the story, according to this book, is never swallow a horse. There was an old lady who swallowed a fly. A favorite American folk poem was first heard in the United States in the 1940s. Several different versions from Georgia, Colorado, and Ohio were collected for Hoosier folklore in December of 1947. But its true author remains unknown.